Hello Libras, this is your pick a deck reading for January 26th through February 1st. This is to see how your person feels about you, okay? So this is deck one, two, and three. You guys, you can pick one, you can pick two, you can pick three, however many you want, okay? Um, but as long as you guys get the message out of it that really resonates with you, okay? So let's go ahead and get started. Let me move these out of the way. For my Libras, this is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. Let's see what's going on with the person that you guys are thinking about here. Deck one, Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. How do they feel about my Libras? How do they feel? How do they feel? Hmm. I just saw the um, emperor there that time. Stubborn. Maybe an Aries you guys are dealing with, thinking about. Um, they feel like you're not willing to open up to them that they've offered you something um they feel like they could have made you happy but you refuse to see it you refuse to take it okay yeah that you don't want you don't want to have anything to do with them basically um that you've got your back turned as far as them offering like you know to start something with you okay like you're not interested Knight of Swords. I think they want to really, you know, tell you the truth about, um, they want to tell you the truth about something, okay? They want to speak honestly and open, openly with you. Or this is you guys wanting to, you know, talk about what it is that this person offered you or is offering you. Um, I feel like if this is you, like you're kicking against this new start, like hell no, you know, I don't want anything with you and you want to tell them the truth of um, why, okay? And if this is a person, then they want, to, they want to know why you are ignoring them, why you're not accepting what, you know, they're offering you here, okay? Two of Cups there. Uh, somebody has some very deep feelings for you and I feel like um, I feel like this person cancer energy I feel like this is something that you guys share um, I think right now you're just over it for whatever reason only you guys know that um, maybe you feel like it was strictly a sexual thing here with the Ace of Wands. Like, you know, there was no, you know, deep emotion involved here. And I think somebody wants to tell you, no, that's not the case. Hmm. That they just really see you guys being together and being happy. They feel like, you know, you're for them and they're for you. They want to speak openly and honestly about, about how they feel towards you. Hmm. Leo energy. And then we have the chariot in reverse. But I don't think that, um, I don't think you're hearing it. I don't think you want to go forward with them. You do not see that it would be something that would be beneficial for you. And I think you're just wanting to just let it be, let it go, let it go. You want to, you know, go your own way, basically. Kind of just want to be left alone. Um, I think that there's something that bothers you about this, though. Because initially, you did see that, you know, this could go somewhere. You really did. You really thought it was going somewhere, but something happened here um, that brought it to a halt. Okay? So Cancer, Leo, um, Aquarius, Energy, maybe Aries. I saw that Emperor. Okay? For you guys. Turn that around because I do not put my cards in reverse. <clears throat> 
Let's see for deck two. What's going on? How do they feel about my Libras? Deck two. How do they feel about my Libras? How do they feel? How do they feel? Hmm. They feel like you've turned your back. Um, that there's something that you've realized that's maybe you should go your own way. And I feel like, you know, this is reluctance on your part, but I think you feel like it's what's best for you. You almost just want to be left alone here, you know, to figure out, you know, figure out your shit by yourself without any interference here. Okay. Taurus energy. Hmm. They feel like they have to leave you alone. I think I think you've put your foot down here. And I think that's why the Knight of Pentacles is here. Taurus energy, because you know, the Taurus, the bull, okay? Stubborn. You know, I've said it. <clears throat> Excuse me, I've said it. And you know, it's final. That's it. And like they're being forced to walk away because, you know, there's nothing that, that you're offering them at this point. Okay. They feel like you have just, you know, turned your back on it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Aquarius energy. And that's, this is your path. Um, I think... Whatever it is that you are, um, whatever decision you have made, I feel like, you know, you're doing the right thing. I think some of you need to hear that. Um, Aquarius energy here. But I also think you guys are walking towards your destiny. And it could very well be an Aquarius person. Um, but there's somebody that you've turned your back on here. Pisces energy. Um, maybe Scorpio. And I feel like you're walking right towards something that um, that you guys are meant to do or somebody that you're meant to be with. Okay. Page of Wands there. I feel like somebody was trying to get away with something here. And I feel like they were very childish. I feel like they still watch you. They observe you. Strong Pisces energy here. They may be a cusper between Pisces and Aquarius. But um, yeah, I feel like they still they still watch you. They, they hate to see you walk away. But, you know, you're good with it. You're good with being by yourself right now. I feel like you guys are very confident. I feel like you know what it is that you want and you're not accepting anything less than that. Period. Virgo energy here. Yeah. Now, this doesn't mean that you guys, you know, do not want a commitment. It's just that you know what you want right now. And, you know, what you want, you don't see it. So, you know, you're good right now being single. Okay, until what you want comes into your view. Okay, and what you want is somebody that's going to work with you, that's going to give you what you give them. No more, no less. That's all you want. Okay, that's all you want. But what's funny is <laughs> this person. This person wants to give you what it is that they feel like you want. They want to work with you regardless. If they didn't, if they weren't contributing enough or doing enough before, it's like now they want to. They want to. And I feel like, but I don't really feel like they're they're in this mature state. I feel like they're doing things kind of sneakily and um, just kind of sitting back and observing you right now. But I feel like they definitely want to be with you. They definitely want to, to do that, okay? 
So Capricorn energy there. All right. So that's deck two. Moving on to deck three for my Libras. Let's see. Libras. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. How do they feel about my Libras? Libras. How do they feel? King of Cups. This person loves you. They want to take care of you. Um, I feel like they're a little stubborn, though. And I feel like they are entitled. They, they, they're entitled. They feel entitled. They miss you. They regret whatever it is that they have done. Um, they feel like all is lost with you, though, Scorpio energy. They feel like they can't, you know, regroup. They come across like they're okay, but they're not. This person's not okay. Mm -mm. They're still hurt. They're trying to move on, but they are, you know, they're holding on to, to the pain, to the hurt here. They feel like all is lost, um, but they want it back. And they know they hurt you. They know they disappointed you here, okay? Aquarius energy. Yeah, Ace of Cups there. They, they want to get back with you. Strong Scorpio energy here. They want to tell you how they really feel. Without hiding, without feeling, you know, being arrogant. They want to tell you that they feel like you guys are meant to be. Hmm. This is somebody from your past. For most of you. Somebody that you've been with before. Um, somebody that I feel like you've known a long time. For most of you. Then we have the Four of Swords here. Yeah. Yeah. This person's heartbroken. And they feel like they disappointed you. They feel like you. they disappointed you here. You're not talking to them at all. You're ignoring them. And they're trying so hard to get your attention. And I don't know what that is. They're trying so very hard to get your attention here. Yeah. They want to start over. They're very attracted to you. Um and want to start over. They want to offer you something. They want to tell you this. But they, they're just afraid that you're not going to hear it nor accept it here. With this water and fire, very Scorpio. You guys have a Scorpio, um, for a lot of you, that is really hung up on you. Okay? We also have um, Aquarius here. Maybe another Libra. Okay, guys? So that's what I have for you guys, and I will be speaking with you soon.